Grandpa Newbie reporting for duty with another relatively powerful battle rifle build. Like I've said before, it's getting close to the end of life for Modern Warfare 3, so it's time to try some new things. Get wild, get woolly, take some risks. When I released the video on the MCW 6.8, several of you said that the weapon was junk. And a couple mentioned the MTZ 7.62, so I thought I'd take a look at that. And here it is. This is the configuration that I came up with. Now, I tried the conversion kit on it, but it really didn't seem to shine for me. So let's have a look at the configuration I decided on the first thing of course is the jack cutthroat stock when it's available i use it ads movement speed up to 3.6 so with a battle rifle you have smg like ability to dodge left and right forward and back whatever the mtc aggressor grip again it helps with the ads movement speed these are composite numbers movement speed of 5.6 sprint speed of 5.4 let's have a look at the damage though 58 to the head 49 to the torso lower torso and even 45 to the upper legs you're shooting at almost 10 rounds a second 540.5 rounds per minute and the bullet velocity is 790 meters per second so that's an outstanding bullet velocity the effective damage range a little short for a battle rifle at less than 20 and the hit scan range is going to be roughly 80 800 divided by 240 so your hit scan range goes all the way out to 40 meters well past the effective damage range the 762 by 51 30 round mag and i wanted a few extra bullets to carry with me this one worked out quite well for me you can see that reload quickness goes up by 10 percent actually and 3.3 percent on the empty it does hurt mobility but not to a measurable degree ads is at 256 which is an awesome and sprint to fire is also a midland 209 millisecond seconds the xrk edge bw4 hand stop and that helps with the ads movement speed the ads speed the sprint to fire speed at six percent it helps recover some of that mobility hurts on the hip fire and tack stance i don't plan on doing much tack stance now this is one build where i don't use the paracord if i had used the paracord you can see that only sprint to fire was significantly better the MTZ Rowan XL 356 barrel. That helps again with ADS and sprint to fire. It doesn't help my ADS movement speed, but sprint speed, tactical sprint speed in very minor ways. It impacts the recoil, but I didn't have a lot of recoil with this weapon. And speaking of recoil, let's go on to the shooting range and have a quick look. See, just straight as an arrow. Now, the one thing about this weapon is that there's a lot of smoke coming out the sides. I don't know if it ever got uh, the update they did way back, I think, in Season 1 to help clear some of that smoke out. So maybe a different barrel would help on that, but it was definitely something that I noticed while I was playing. And speaking of playing, let's take the MTZ 762 onto the Field of Honor. See how it did for Grandpa in Free For All, what it did to Grandpa's enemies. Let's go. All right, let's give the 762 a whirl and see what comes out of the dryer. Can you see all that smoke that gets in your way when you fire the weapon? I thought they'd handled that. Well, so far, so good. I mean, I be honest, I didn't expect a lot. I just wanted to try it out since people said the MCW 6.8 was doggy do, And they suggested the MTZ. You know, I'm not using it single shot because I found that single shot, it, it just didn't get enough of a didn't get enough bullets down range for me seems to be fairly po powerful <laughs> oh this poor guy this poor guy oh i don't know what happened there i think i yacked that guy actually there's a 
I don't know what he was doing hanging off there. Elvis was hanging on the corrugated box there. The shipping container. Elvis is hiding in a shipping container. Grandpa's getting a situational awareness up. He always did that. And when I was flying fighters, you kept your situational awareness up. You know what it's called when you've... There's Elvis, I think. What it's called when you lose your situational awareness, the radio call is tumbleweed. You'd say, I am tumbleweed, and looks like... The mosquito drone put that guy tumbleweed. Does it feel powerful? Yeah, it does. I mean, Grandpa drop shots a drop shot, or that guy was quick to drop shot before, so I was I got ahead of the the curve on him. Throw out a welcome mat. Ooh, let's see. I told you, told you. Grandpa's watching himself get gacked. I think once I built up a few points, there he is again. Insta drop shot. Likes to sniff the ground. Kind of like my new puppy. Sometimes you need to say I love you with a Renetti. Chase him into the cluster mine. Life is good. Once, once I got a few points ahead, some of the better players just abandoned the lobby. I don't know. Maybe it's a bit arrogance, but Grandpa believes no matter how far behind he gets, you can always come back. I've come back from... Being down 14 GAX before in free-for-all and in Modern Warfare 3. In fact, I think I put that one in a video. Often I spawn in 7 to 10 GAX down in free-for-all. I like free-for-all more than multiplayer. I guess it's multiplayer. It's a mode, but I like the mode because it's you against everybody else. It's like flying a single-seat fighter. And for those of you who like to play Team Deathmatch, on objective, on hard points, on domination rather than go for the objective, you, you ought to consider playing free-for-all. I just thought there was a lot of smoke coming off the weapon in this first game here. Was there somebody that... I don't even know what happened there. So it obscured the target. And that guy's just standing there picking daisies and should know that inside a building you won't find any so he'll be forever looking for those daisies little wall bang action got the guy that shot a arrow at me i do like that you can change out the magazine fairly quickly you're back in the fight up oh, he got me got me with the arrow rc 51 i wonder if that means he's 51 years old which would be young He's a, he's a young whippersnapper. See how fast you can re reload. You're back in the fight. Oh, 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 oh. I know I'm going to get back from behind there. Actually, no, that was the 30th kill. So I didn't get a good feeling about the gun. I thought it deserved another try, so I'll play another round of free-for-all with it. Is that guy even looking at me? I guess he was. Snow globe head there. Yeah, you can see that several people had dropped out of the match. Well, two. I don't know if two equals several. This would be the kind of map that the MTZ762 would be really good at. And that is, you have a little longer corridors there. Boy, that was pure luck. Elvis stepped into my bullets. He has left the building. Whoa, Elvis is a hopper. Hop along, Elvis. Take a quick snort there. Those are insure vitamins that you can take. Good, good for people 65 and older. I 
Yeah, this one ain't going quite as quickly. There's the other. Grandpa's down by three. See, Grandpa's not going to leave the... I thought you could shoot it through the glass there, but I guess not. Grandpa's not going to leave the match just because he gets down by a couple. That's a challenge. Who doesn't like a challenge to try to come back? Oh. What is that guy doing? Wall bang him with a Renetti. Once again, I feel like the smoke coming off of this thing when you shoot. Although there, you didn't see any. Kind of obscures. There it is. Obscures the target. So you better be <laughs> have a good shot at them or have them locked into your aim assist and be strafing. There's a lot of smoke coming up there. Looking for folks. Trying to find a parking place. There we go. Oh boy, you can, there's a lot of equipment flying in the sky right now. Is that a zombie? And I think the, uh, oh, somebody stepped on the cluster mine. It's the gift that keeps on giving, Clark. I kind of like this map because I like airports. I don't know who's trying to shoot me in from where there he is. Oh, he's trying to beat me down. I'm trying to, a little elder abuse there. So I gacked him. Whoa. Little hip shot. Thing worked good on the hip shot. Where'd he go? He disappeared. This is where he went, I bet. Yep, there's his footprints. You'd think I'd be following him? See, with the smoke up there, that guy stopped, turned, and he almost got me because I was leading him. And through the smoke, I couldn't really tell right away that he had stopped running. Enemy UAV active. Yeah, I, I think it's a reasonable weapon. You could get challenges done with it. Obviously, I got the Interstellar. But you know what? Probably not a permanent class for me. I think there are better battle rifles out there. All right, but I'm interested here in your opinion. You guys like the MTZ 762? Grandpa got a little rhythm in them. Let me know in the comments below. And I appreciate you watching. I appreciate all the support out there. Old guy in his channel. Cheers. Peace to you. Please like and subscribe. Helps me. Helps the fam. See ya.